Hi everybody, it's Caitlin, and today I'm going to be doing an updated journal collection because my second video here on this channel was a journal collection and I tried to film one of these last week but it messed up and the video got deleted. So now I'm going to film it this week. So I'm going to start with my current journals and these are my current journals. Um, I have a separate video on all of these and the one I was writing in at that time. So yes, I have my sketchbook, future book, um, poetry one. This one's actually a newer one. So this is a journal from first class. It says here on the back. It has a pocket in the front. And I use this for like when I need to study something. Just I've only been using it a little bit for one test I had and I'll just put the thing I'm learning about in the cover of that. So yeah, those are my current journal. Now I'm going to move on to my used up filled journals that I use for daily journaling. So this is the first one I ever wrote in and I'm just going to show you a few pages from this. Here's a sketch I did that I was really proud of at the time. A page that I wrote on. I just hit myself in the note. This is my second journal that I used. And this is what it looks like. It has a dog on it, and I'll just show you once again a couple pages from this one. Here's a sketch I did that I was proud of, so I stuck it in here. It has a picture of my dog on it, and this is May 1st of 2015, which is almost a year ago. This is journal number three, also from the Dollarama. It has a sticker from Citadel Hill and a picture of my mom and I. If you can see that, it's like the lighting is really terrible in here. Yeah, there you go. So this is the cover. This page I completely filled with tickets from a 50-50 draw that we were in, and this is what the back looks like. Journal number four looks like this. The inside cover of this, I actually really like. It's a picture my sister drew, so I just wrote Caitlin Ross there. There's like a house plan in here as well. This one I filled up super quick. I was just writing pages and pages and pages of writing. This is journal number five. I got this at Michael's. All the other ones that I had previously mentioned are from the Dollarama. So, um, that's what the inside cover looks like in the front. And the back cover has autographs on it from friends and family. It's writing in color, sticking things in. I'll show you a few pages when we went to PEI. So I have that stuff in this. Journal number six. It's an Anne of Green Gables journal I got while I was in PEI. So it has and on it, the inside cover just has quotes. It doesn't have much stuck in. It's mostly just writing. I wasn't drawing much at this time. Here I have a few things from school stuck in. This is a markings journal that I got from the dollar store. It has birds on it, but you cannot tell because my lighting is very terrible there. You can see it like that. So this is the front cover. This is, I think, one of the only ones I haven't flipped through yet. And it's just because, um, I guess I didn't really see the point in flipping through this one. There's not much in here. There's a back pocket and some friend signatures. Once again, this is another one I didn't flip through. This is a artist loft sketchbook and this is number eight. Uh, I don't like the way the cover turned out either. And the back has YouTube Rewind and all the YouTubers that were in that. This is one of the pages I'm kind of proud of. It's like watercolor. I got this mainly for watercolor, but then I just eventually used it for um, that. Here's my December calendar that I did just marking off days. This is journal number nine. This is from Chapters Indigo. I have a flip through of this one on my channel. Yeah, this one was really fun to fill up. This is my current journal. It's a Kate Spade journal. It says, with freedom, books, flowers, and the moon, who could not be happy? Uh, so far, the inside cover looks like this. Um, here's one of today's pages. I wrote on this page as well because I just got a new journal and stuck that in. That piece of thing from the journal. I like that page. That's pretty. Here's a page that I just sketched on, and this is um, ripped here, but it's been lasting pretty good 
um, since it's broken. Like, yeah, I'm that far through it. Thank you all so much for watching. Give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next Sunday. Bye!